Let's walk through the menu items in the MVG30. First option is going to give you the ability to turn on and off the icons you see when you're looking through the display. With this option, you can change through four different color palettes, including white phosphor, green, black and white, and color modes. This option will change the duration of onboard video recording loops. This will allow you to play back through your recorded video files stored on the device. This will turn on the Wi-Fi feature, and we'll be doing a deeper dive on this in another video. This will allow you to turn on a crosshair, and here's a quick look at that. This is an auto IR setting, which you can use to have the IR come on automatic depending on what the device feels is best given your environment. This is a picture in picture mode. It creates a little window at the top of the screen which allows you to zoom in and this is nice because it won't compromise your field of view. You can adjust the LCD brightness with this setting which will help you to conserve battery life. This allows you to set the time and date. This will allow you to set a time to automatically power the device down so you don't accidentally let it run out of batteries. This next option will allow you to change languages. Here we have the frame rate adjustment and you can switch from 30 to 40 frames per second. This will allow you to calibrate the gyro gyroscope and improve the accuracy of the compass. This will allow you to format SD cards and you can record to new SD cards. This will allow you to restore the device to default factory settings and this last option will show you the UI version. Questions can be dropped down below.